credit for. Kathy, she really doesn't. People know Valerie is this wonderful decorator with, with you know, the wreaths and mercury glass, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, she is a busy woman yes. with a busy family. Yes, hard working lady, that's for the, sure. The pace at her house does not stop. So what she did was she created a really wonderful way of being able to have storage in her home and then also the look of great decorative looks. These are faux leather ottomans that are available at a price tag of $59.36. They fold up so that if you decide that you're not going to use them, you can get them out of the way. By the way, most storage is the exact same size when not being used as they are when being used. And these are nice. This is for the individual, and that's all of us, who needs a place to hide things. Yeah, don't we all? Would you agree? We, it, this is for the things that you want at your fingertips, right? but you don't want to have to see them the whole time. Well, see all the stuff. Yeah, in my living room, uh, again, if you did not know me, and you came into my house, it could be very disturbing. I'm very neat. But I've got four dogs. Mm. So at any given point, yeah. there are bones laying around my yeah. living room as if I might be a serial killer. That drives me crazy. You know what I mean? I have two dogs and yeah. the bones all over the floor. So crazy. when the doorbell rings, it's kind of nice to have a place that I can reach over real quickly yes. and throw dog toys into, et cetera, et cetera. But these are big, thick, heavy, oh, gorgeous. gorgeously tufted. And I know it's a faux leather. I, she did such but a good even job. when you touch it, you can't tell it's faux leather. And look at the grain work that Valerie did in there. So it really looks like leather. Um, she added in the tufting detail. This is the chestnut that you're seeing. Nice thick topper, yeah, which is going to flip over and be a tray. The entire um, ottoman uh, collapses. Here are your out of season items, um, your wintertime gloves, all that kind of stuff that you might even during the season, throw them all into here yeah. and put them under the sofa table. So here's Because it's a lot easier set. to go through this than it is that top shelf of the closet. Yes, that's So true. here are our color choice. This, this is gorgeous. It's gorgeous, chocolate brown, but it doubles as black. It, as a matter of fact, Valerie has yes. um, this in her house and uses it as that black. Next I have for you the navy blue. Here's that gorgeous chestnut, chestnut we started off with. Oh, and the ivory has that beautiful grain work also. You can really see it in the ivory. So I think of like a master bedroom or a master bath. For the and this ivory. is interesting. This color is coming back sure into is. Vogue. Olive this is green. olive. I remember olive carpeting in my parents' house in the 60s. Oh, that's right. We had that yes, too in the basement. Uh, you, uh, you, listen, you had two choices. You either had olive or gold. Okay. Or, yeah. um, or, the, or the burnt orange. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here Look you have at this. that beautiful baby blue. Isn't that gorgeous? I love this one for the master bedroom also. And then, of course, Valerie would bring us what is right on trend right now. So we have the gray for you. I'll slide it for you so you can see it a little bit better. <laughs> I, I just started laughing. I apologize. Uh, my technical director, Guy says we've traveled a lot together. We've done shows Aww. all over the world. And, and he saw this color. And he, and he oh. made me laugh. He goes, oh, my gosh. I used to purposely buy the ugliest color luggage so, you could so that I it. could find it on the turnstile. It's actually kind of smart, Dan. And I had luggage, not that this is an ugly color, but for luggage, I had this baby <laughs> blue luggage. My, Does every, anybody have a picture of Dan everyone going I, through the airport Everyone with I traveled that? with gave me fits about that. I would love but guess to see what? a picture of that. Nobody. Nobody ever lost my luggage. Yeah, and you always got could you yours imagine, off the Could you imagine being the baggage handler who went, yeah, I lost it. <laughs> I also had bright yellow. Do you remember that, Hefty? <laughs> yeah. Oh, and I want to show you some of the ideas. See, I think about inside. this stuff. Yeah. It's, hey, Dan, it was a smart idea because when the turn the turnstile was coming around with your luggage, yeah. you could spot yours the fastest. Can I, can I tell you what fits uh. really well in there? Remote. File folder. Oh, yes, perfect. It's the exact size for file folders. And how many cables and remote controls and cords? At, I how about video games? Video games, you know, board games. The, the discs. I love this. Valerie. Oh, baby changing. Right yeah, on, that's a good because idea. Because we all do that. When, when you have the babies, you try to go up 
to the changing table yeah. up in the bedroom. Yeah, 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 yeah. You do that for a while, and then the next thing you know, you're Let doing me, it in the living room. Yeah, so listen, perfect. Uh, that is how interesting is that that you do when you have a first baby? You have a changing, <laughs> oh, yeah, sure, sure. a changing station. <laughs> yes. But nobody ever tells mommy, baby poops whenever it wants to. <laughs> right. And and mommy's going to be so tired. Yes, she's not going to yes, feel like exactly. going upstairs. Exactly. Here's your knitting supplies. So maybe you're putting your different crafting supplies in here. Um, any of the hobbies that you like to do that you need these things. You want it right readily next available. To, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want them right next to the seat, to the couch where you're sitting, but you don't want to see them. And How then you saw. No, I, I could sit on these too. How much weight would these hold? 250 pounds. Beautiful. So when you're having you company over, over. But, yes. but again, the whole idea here, let me grab, I'm going to grab one of these. Ready? If I decide that I don't want it on display, all you do, there's a little handle, you pick up that, and this whole thing folds flat. And now I can slide right under the couch, right under like the bed. That. That's it. So you're using, you're whipping this out when company's coming over for extra seating. We have it for you next to the couch. Well, um, and you can flip over the top then, and you can use the top as a tray. So if I wanted to, I could put my coffee here and the book that I'm working on. Yep. Um, I could use it as a tray. But otherwise, you're kicking your feet up at the end of the long day. It's nice and soft and cushioned. Kathy, uh, Kelly and I uh, travel by motor coach because ah. she will not fly. Okay. Uh, to find something like this that's really nice upscale look. Yes. I've seen this concept before, but they they didn't look as nice. She really, Valerie nailed the look of leather. I agree. And you're seeing there, um, in a moment you're gonna see, we have the benches. To match. To yes. match, uh, all the, in the, the exact benches, same The colors. benches are a little bit more expensive. Twice 66, as big. Yeah, $66.36.